Hello and welcome. I'm Gerald Fishbach, and these are my young friends. Hi, my name is Joseph. Hi, I'm Erica. I'm Carmen. I'm Fadalala. Hello, I'm Heather. My name is Ted. And I'm Casey. Together, we're going to explore one of a string player's favorite topics, vibrato. Yeah! The birth of a vibrato is a special moment for a student, one likely to be remembered for a lifetime. With the acquisition of vibrato, a string player reaches a new level of tonal maturity, sophistication, and responsibility. Vibrato is the frosting on the tonal cake. It sweetens the flavor of our sounds and makes it more interesting, more colorful, more complex. Vibrato also adds intensity to our sound. As a tool for strengthening our emotional message, it helps us to laugh and to weep, to sing of love, and to shout in anger. A well-balanced vibrato can actually make playing feel easier by helping the left hand and arm stay well aligned and balanced. Vibrato can also play an important supporting role in connecting notes when you learn to pour your vibrato from one note to the next without stopping it. We will demonstrate a few of my personal favorite approaches to vibrato acquisition. Approaches designed to help translate everyday actions into the more sophisticated motion patterns of vibrato on a string instrument. Once a vibrato has been born, we will look further into the development and maturation of the vibrato on the road to artistry. The exercises presented here and a supporting anthology of wonderful songs are found in the Chos publication, Viva Vibrato, which I co-authored with my good friend and colleague, Dr. Robert Frost. This presentation and Viva Vibrato work especially well together. We wish you a happy journey on the highway to vibrato.